is just fun to be around. She's a special person. She's a great comedian. Um, Facebook, you get to know her a little bit more about her family and friends, dynamite people. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Kristen Hutchinson, please. <laughs> Thank you so much, Jay. Hope everyone's having a great night tonight. I love coming to Searchlight. It's such a fun night. Um, so I'm a bartender, and you know, being a bartender, you have to talk to a lot of different people on a nightly basis. And I really do a good job of it, and I'm actually bilingual, and I don't know if you know what that means, but I can actually speak male and female. It's very helpful nowadays with this new battle of the sexes that's going on. And I actually think that this battle of the sexes that we have right now is made by, you know, the tech companies. Because if they continue the way they're going, men and women will hate each other so much we won't be to fuck robots, you know? <laughs> so when I'm at work, I kind of have to turn on different ways. When I look at the guys, I'm like, guys, what happened with the bees last night? What the fuck? I'm going to learn when on Thursday or what? The guys like, you know it. I'm like, don't be such a Sally. Drink that fucking beer. And then a bunch of ladies come in. I'm like, how are we doing, ladies? Girls night out, espresso martinis? Yeah. Oh, take your picture? No problem. And let me guess, funny music? Sure, let's have some fun and dance our way out of here. <laughs> you know, bartending's a lot of fun. You meet a lot of people. And um, it makes me appreciate my husband. I'm going to celebrate our 20th anniversary. And we actually like each other. I know, it's pretty crazy. You never hear that, do you? Everyone wants to talk about how much they hate their husband and wife, but we're doing pretty good. And people say, well, what's your secret? And I'm like, well, obviously, he works days, I work nights. It's like so great to see each other. <laughs> Another thing that's pretty funny too is a lot of people don't realize like the secret to men. They're really simple. Feed them, fuck them, rub their belly. They're good to go. They don't want to go anywhere, you know? <laughs> the friends will call and say, hey, we're going to go watch The Beast tonight. What do you think? Oh, I don't know. She's making lasagna. She might rub my belly. You know what? I'll take a rain check maybe next night. <laughs> no, seriously though, what a wise one once told me, what a man wants in a woman is a lady in the living room, his mom in the kitchen, a whore in the bedroom. So when I bill my husband and leaves me money, I don't feel guilty when I go shopping the next day because I fucking earn that shit, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Seriously, ladies, don't worry. I'm a real woman, you know? I make my own money, just kidding. But I actually grew up in the old school days when we had the first wing of, like, feminism, you know, like, when we actually women were, like, strong, sexy, smart, and they actually liked men back then, yeah. And uh, there was this commercial I used to love. It was for Anjali Perfume, I don't know if you remember. It goes, I can bring home the bacon and fry it up in a pan. But I'll never let you forget you're a man Cause I'm a woman Anjali And I was like, yes! That's the type of woman I'm gonna be I'm gonna be the fucking boss I'm not gonna get coffee from men You know what I'm saying? And uh, that's how I kind of like learned how to like rule my life So nowadays they want to bring that perfume back And they have to do a new commercial But that is not gonna work with today's women So they rewrote it and it goes like this I brought home the bacon And I fried it in the pan And I'm asking myself Why the fuck do I need a man? Thank you everybody, that's my time Oh my goodness, Kristen Hutchinson, folks, keep it going. That is one funny girl.